from Edinburgh again, Christy Gillis Park, it's Civil Service Trollers versus Galafirian Rovers in the Lowland League. Another tough game today. Uh, I noticed you've got uh, injuries at Danny injured. Yeah, You'll be a big miss. Yeah, Danny, uh, his calf went against Hearts uh, a couple of weeks ago. Uh, he will be a big miss, but just have to look after it. He's, he's getting a wee bit... He's, he's getting to an age now that everything takes a wee bit longer. And we've also got Gareth Rogers, our captain, out as well. So right. two big misses today. Yeah. Gareth got uh, two yellows against Berwick last week. So, uh-huh. so, so we're, we've got the two boys. But there's a couple back in for, for sickness and injury. Yeah. Callum and Jared, we've got in for Hamilton. So... Aye, it's all positive, we've got a big enough squad, so we're expecting a good result, good positive result. Aye, another tough game against uh, Gala Freddy Rovers. Uh, how's, how's the squad doing? I know there's been some movement back and forward. Uh, yeah, so Hibbs uh, recalled Malik and he's gone to Edinburgh City, so he's getting a chance to play at a high level. Um, and then we've uh, recently we've brought in Josh McCulloch ourselves um, and David Churchill just uh, yeah. to help bolster the squad, give us some more options. And uh, but you've still got the, the the usual backbone of the team. Yeah. So we had the we should have had three games in a week. Um, so it's tough because Trinent were in there twice. Um, and we got off to a great start. So we, won, we managed to win two of them, and then the yeah. third game fell victim to the weather. Um, so really, we we're glad we had the friendly against Spartans, um, and just good to get back to business and hopefully start the year in a good way. I've got your strollers number one fan. Well, it must be one of the few. It must be in the top ten. <laughs> right, uh, so how have you enjoyed the last few games then? Well, they have been enjoyable because I think the, the strollers have won more than they've actually lost. Yeah. Although their away form is much better than their home form. Which is weird, eh? <laughs> Strange. We look forward to today's game because you know, Gallifrey and are uh, Rovers are a, a good day uh, outfit, yeah? Yeah, they are. And um, I think it'll be much of the same for the strollers. Um, we'll, we'll be waiting to the very end to see what happens. Yeah. It's not a guarantee of anything. No, no, definitely not. Okay. Enjoy the day's game then. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. There's the kick-off. Uh, as the uh, strollers are in uh, all red and Galafield and Dinovas are in the east up there. Oh, there's a chance here. Cut back, but he'd be there. Oh, there's a chance here. There we go. A long throw in there, and uh, we go. Oh, there's another chance. Oh, there's a flexion as well. Let's see if we go, eh? We'll see what we've got to the game. Oh, it's a corner. Oh, 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 <laughs> I'm not even going to try and describe that. Oh, 
Oh, chance here, not over the bar. It's a uh, oh, offside, I think. There you go, half time. Who would have thought uh, 5 0? I would never have predicted that. Uh, 5 0 is to us. So, what do you think of the first half? Uh, well, it's been all civil service. Uh, they played the ball well, one touch football, moved it forward. Everything they've hit, they went in goals. Yeah. Three, three cracking goals. Gala and Fairness have not been at the races today. No. I think I've missed a couple of key players, and I think that tells, you know. Uh, it certainly does. It doesn't help when you've got Danny and uh, Ethan and all these yeah. boys out here. Steady players, eh? When That's you're right. playing again, civil service are a good team. Yeah. But it's still not, they've not taken any chances, they've not created anything, so it's not like Gala. No, that's right. I mean, I'm surprised as well. Yeah. Yeah, the half time scoreline, I think people would be looking, thinking it's a typo, you know. I've never, I've never seen them play as, as bad in the first half in all yeah. season. Uh, hopefully, they can perform a wee bit better in the second half. Yeah. Uh, got a couple of goals at least. Yeah. As long as their heads don't go down. I'm glad the uh, first, first visit here. Uh, very good first half by uh, civil service trolls. Impressive and uh, controlling the game and uh, Gala Ferradine haven't really had a chance so far so and they uh, keep the work up. Yeah, I'll pro probably I'll give it two halves now because the Gala have to come out I suppose. Eh? Oh they've got to, they've got to, got to show something and hopefully, well, at least get a consolation goal yeah. even if that. So where do you normally visit? Do you do ground hopping? Do you go about the place? Yeah, yeah. This is my 244th ground. Very good. Come up from the uh, northeast of England today. Right. For, for the, well, for the Neapol game. Oh, right, that Cowden was called Beef, off. And that was called off, so uh -huh. I've come across here now. Oh, to good. Assist. Oh, well. As long as you're enjoying yourself, yeah. Absolutely, great game. And uh, yeah, nice little ground, really. 
Yeah, thanks very much. No problem. Good. Well, there he goes. It was the PV week. Glenn from the north of England there. Uh, coming up for a, a game that was called off. Uh, Love I think it was, he said. And uh, there was quite a lot of games called off. So, he came here. <laughs> so, good to see him. There'll uh, be another ground he's ticked off. And we're just, the teams are just out for kick-off there. This is my way around to my usual position. And there's kick-off. Another long throw. There we go. Oh, that was defending there. So, hey, you were at the Hearts B game then. 12 0. I should have gone to that, eh? <laughs> yeah, good stuff. Hey, lads. Wait till they're there. There's a free kick to Gala here. Oh, we're all going to ball through. Oh, no, no, nothing, no. Oh, John's here. Oh, good save. Oh, that's a shot and target for Gala. If it's all position, this half. Fair sent off, the second yellow there, he was booked in the first half. That's him sent off. Oh! That was a, a brilliant goal. Well done. Oh, there we go. 
Take a laugh at it. There we go. Still laugh at it. Now we're done. Oh, Some of don't know. Oh, there's a chance here. Oh, no. I think that sums up Gala's day. Oh, oh, I'm pretty on the next well done. There we go. Oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> Stop me, yeah. oh. oh, no, oh, that was too far away. That's the coin on a go here. There we go, there's full time and it's a, a fatty victory for the civil service doors. A fatty victory day, what pleased you most about today's performance? I think the energy we showed and I think the, the, the pressure, the togetherness in eh, the group, I think that eh, we've been trying for the, the last couple of months to, to get a togetherness and the, the groups, they play together, you know, I think they're, they're, they're good players. Um, and they would taken ownership of the, the, the game for the start to be. Yeah, what I was impressed with the day was the pressure you were putting on constantly on Gala. You just didn't let them settle. I know maybe it wasn't the best Gala performance, but I think you created that, if you know what I mean. You made... No, you're absolutely spot. I think um, we won down at Gala early in the season, but they were a better team. And I think they, they moved the ball really well. Um, Jimmy's got some kind of good young players there, yeah. good patterns they play. And if... If you stand off them, then they'll take you apart. So I think I probably overemphasised that at the start um, in team talk. But the players went out, took on board that, and I think they enjoyed enjoyed it for the start, to be honest. Yeah, and some cracking goals as well. No, as I think Harry's worked really hard over the last for the season, to be honest. And uh, today he's got his reward. But I think again, we know the single end of it out. I think it was a yeah. good team performance. I think there's stuff that that we can continue to improve on, which again is great for a manager when in. And uh, the stuff that you can get better at. That's great, Gary. Thank you very much. Uh, and a fat victory, Dave. But what will be pleasing is the performance of all the players, the whole team. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I think you've just said it right. Yeah, I think it was a team performance. Um, obviously, Gallagher, a, a good team, a good footballing team. Um, but we worked really hard as a group. Um, and as I said, we were we were clinical when we got our chances. That's right. And as always, as always, I mean, I know it was seven goals, but it's always good to see a good spread. Uh, including yourself, yeah. of course, uh, scoring. Yeah, no, definitely. Obviously, Harry got his hat trick. Um, yeah. Robbie Cole got one as well. Obviously, myself. Um, I can't even remember the other scorers, but to be honest, like you say, it's good um, the goal score throughout the team rather than just depending on the strikers. And I think the tactics today was just no let Gala settle, hard press all the time. Mm -hmm. And I think that message from the manager got through to you. Yeah, Gala are a good team. Um, play good football. Obviously, Jimmy Jimmy Scott's got them playing well. Uh, Martin Scott, sorry, has got them playing well. Um, yeah. And they've got some good players. You can give them time on the ball. 
they can hurt you. Um, but our game plan worked and obviously the result was really good.